Wow. That's a terrific sight, Dad, isn't it? Yes, absolutely. It's amazing, these are called clouds. In fact, they are one of the most beautiful sights while flying high within the troposphere. What exactly are clouds? Clouds are a collection of water droplets or ice crystals floating within the troposphere. A cloud can weigh as much as the airplane we are on. Why doesn't it fall? Even though a cloud weighs tons, it doesn't fall because the rising air responsible for its formation keeps the cloud floating in the air. The air below the cloud is denser than the cloud. Thus it keeps it floating in the sky. This sounds very interesting. Are they just a decoration of the troposphere? Of course not. Clouds are important for Earth's weather and climate. They form when water evaporates from larger bodies of water and condense around particles in the air due to changes in temperature. They are really important. I didn't know that. But can you tell me how they are formed? It is really a long process, and it starts when the energy from the sun heats water on Earth's surface. The heat gain causes water to change from a liquid to a gas in a process called evaporation. Water evaporates from various surfaces such as oceans, lakes and rivers. Water also evaporates from organisms. As the water vapor rises, it changes into liquid water in a process called condensation. The liquid water condenses around dust or pollen grains, forming water droplets. Billions of these water droplets become a cloud. It is definitely a long process. We can never imagine this when we see clouds decorating our sky. But, are there different types of clouds? Yes, there are different types of clouds. But the three common types are Cumulus clouds Stratus clouds Cirrus clouds How is each type different from the other? I'm really interested to understand how they are different. It is simple. Cumulus clouds are puffy clouds that look like fluffy cotton balls. They can be large or small. And the largest cumulus clouds can cause thunderstorms and weigh several tons. The second type is called stratus clouds, they hang low in the sky. And they often cause light rain and fog. Stratus clouds usually cover all the visible sky like a sheet. A sheet of clouds? What a wonderful metaphor! Thanks! The third and last common type is called cirrus cloud. They usually appear very high up in the troposphere. They are made out of ice crystals, and they do not produce snow or rain. Cirrus clouds are sometimes referred to as Mara's tail because of their appearance. You should know that there are three types of clouds. Cumulus clouds, stratus clouds, cirrus clouds. Cumulus clouds are puffy clouds that look like fluffy cotton balls. They can cause thunderstorms. Stratus clouds hang low in the sky.